Raiders, Wives. Now, the beginning of tonight, take us back. We've been on the red carpet at your world premiere of a film about your love life. Tell us how that feels, like being here on your premiere night. Incredibly surreal. Um, definitely a dream come true. Um, looking up the street to, you know, a sea of people on the red carpet is just, was a, was a dream come true. Yeah, really exciting. Yeah, it'd feel a lot better if my, my feet weren't so sore from these heels. But if they weren't sore, I believe I would feel ecstatic and um, just really overwhelmed and grateful that everybody made it here tonight. Can you enliken this to any other experience that you've ever been through before? Tonight, I guess our wedding would be a similar yeah. kind of experience. You know, getting everyone we love together in one spot um, for celebration. So yeah, tonight definitely feels feels like our wedding times two. Times 15 actually, times the <laughs> amount of people that are here. It's just like a wedding on acid. <laughs> so it's, it's a big job, but the Civic is, um, it's nostalgic. It's somewhere where I used to go when I was really little and I, I couldn't figure it out walking in. It was, it was daylight and then coming inside and it, it was like walking through the back of the wardrobe in Narnia. It, 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 it took you to another place and so it was a no-brainer to have our a premiere of our very first feature here at this amazing establishment. This was a love story that everybody got involved in and invested in. I mean, we all had the feels and the ladies on screen this evening really portrayed you guys really well. Talk us through that. Well, I mean, people can look at the story and say, well, those two vessels fit in this category, but the only category we want to be in is um, love. And I think that it resonated with so many people because it's, it's really our truth. And our truth is just pure love. And that's what this film is about. Yeah, I mean, the message of the film is, you know, it doesn't matter, you know, man, woman, gay, straight, when we all fall, we all fall the same. And that's generally awkward, hard, you know, and um, some pretty embarrassing moments. When you're looking from the lectern back at that audience and it's just filled with people, man, what an overwhelming feeling. As a filmmaker, as a human, it's just, you know, cracking it. I also um, relate this feeling to when Rachel and the kids bought me a PlayStation for Christmas. It always comes back to PlayStation. Ooh. The feels. Always. The feels. The feels. Yeah. Oh, you guys cracked me up. Congratulations again and go and have a bloody good party. Okay. Thank you. Thanks, Dan. We, we will. Thank you for being amazing. Yeah. I, I go would, watch the film. I would move if, if I could, but my feet are so sore from the heels. <laughs> I'll just stay here for a little bit. <laughs> just, just, yeah, fade out. Pull focus, something else. <laughs> yeah! <Yay! laughs> I really enjoyed it. Yeah, I, I really laughed and I thought it was just had such a kind of warmth and heart to it. I found it really beautiful, yeah. This amazing story, it's a true love story first and foremost. But the thing is, it shows not only the great and the multitude of talent that comes out of New Zealand, but also the fact that the movie actually speaks about love and how important love is to so many people. Oh, just congratulations on their first movie. They did an awesome job. I'm so proud of both of them. Yeah, it's fantastic. Uh, I think it was amazing, to be honest. I'm, I've always been fully supportive of Rachel's um, journey in all of this. And um, my beautiful daughter here, Jet Morris, that uh, was in the film strongly, so yeah, no, amazing, amazing. He for no tata Rachel Kiahau, come to Potetaki Haere Maiahau, Potetoto Po, Ite Kau Papa, Natime e Arubia na Eia, Hanataha Maori. And along that journey, she met Nikki, and Nikki is absolutely amazing. And Rachel and Nikki's film, it was something special. We read the script, we loved the script, it was so funny, it reflected them and to see it on the screen and all its humour and all the love with all the character and charisma and personality that's those two ladies on that screen it was just thrilling, it was wonderful. What did I love most about it? I think I love that mix of humour and heart. I think um, it's really, really Nikki's voice on screen. Like, I really wanted it to be fu as funny as Nikki is as a person, and it is. I love that moment, that kind of falling in love moment where everything went blurry, and it was sort of like, I know, I had the same feeling myself, so you know. 
you totally get invested in it and you you know it doesn't matter if it's men or women or whatever it is it's just this film about two people who are meant to be together just coming together so you can't help but but get invested in it have you got any words for Nikki and Rachel love you guys thanks for believing in me when I didn't believe in myself but yeah no uh, everything Hannah set up on stage honored privileged wonderful you guys blow every aspect of my mind so thank you so thank you thank you my god thank you that was a very cool film to work on lovely Nikki and Rachel made it a very lovely atmosphere I felt very strong playing that character because of course Nikki who she is um, is very strong and if I could portray just an inch of that I feel like I've accomplished something so yeah I think everyone did really well and we can every all of us can walk away feeling feeling good and feeling like we've, we've spread a, a beautiful message to everyone about love absolutely fabulous Kiwiana film at its best love actually watch out just fabulous absolutely so proud Kiwi filmmakers these girls have really done it and they need to be recognised across New Zealand, it's just wonderful. I think I've heard people buzzing about the music, Helen Corey's music, loving that, loving the humour, the comedy, the subtlety of so many moments that have been um, beautifully edited together. The, the timing of everything is glorious, I could hear the whole audience peppered with laughter and blowing up with laughter and feeling the falling in love and the sadness. It was a very, very beautiful film.